hi guys welcome back to my youtube channel i go by the name konanani maparapatwa if you're new here please please do subscribe share like and comment not forgetting that notification bell down there and if you're coming back queen king uh, what do you do welcome back and thank you guys for the support the family is growing road to 200 subscribers please do subscribe and guys as you saw by the title of the video today i'll be showing you guys on how i achieved this color this brown gold what what dun, 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 color so if you're interested on finding out how i I achieved this color and how on how I dyed the hair too. Please stay tuned and yeah. So that is the hair that I'll be bleaching and that's the closure. I'll be showing you guys how to bleach your knots today in this video. So that is the bleach. So I bought my bleach from Clicks and you can get it from any clicks here in south africa so this is the bleach that i bought however you can also use any bleach any brand that you prefer so in this big box you get like a comb um gloves your powder the cap and the liquid whatever whatever and yeah Since I'll be dyeing the whole hair, so I'll mix the developer and the powder. There's no need for me to measure anything as you guys can see. So I'm just going to mix uh, the two products together. Just mix them, make sure that um, at the end it's like a paste, you'll see. I'm done with mixing the two products. Guys, make sure that you wear your gloves because bleach, bleach, yeah, chisa. <laughs> Sorry about that. Bleach, uh, yeah, chisa, it's hot. So make sure that you wear your gloves for safety. So right now, I'm just going to take section by section. I'm starting from the bottom and apply the paste like so. As you can see, what I'm doing right now. So I'm just going to do uh like so yeah
as you guys can see that every time after applying the bleach i go in with my comb just to make sure or bleach it again So now when you get to the top, you need to be careful and take your time because you don't want to bleach from the roots unless if you want the wig to be like that. But I preferred um, just bleaching it but not straight from the roots. You see what I'm talking about. Just take your time. Don't take too much time but you must relax.
so right now i'm bleaching my knots as you can see that it's like a paste it's not runny so you're just going to tap on top of, of your closure so the reason why i'm doing this i'm doing this for my closure to be more natural that's the reason why we bleach our knots So after applying the dye, the bleach, whatever you want to call it, um, you're just going to wait for like 40 minutes because I don't want it to be like blonde, blonde. I want it to be like dark, darkish. You see, you see. It's 40 minutes later. So right now I'm just going to wash my wig. Make sure that you wash your wig because you want to make sure okay, there's no bleach left there's no dye left wash your wig and i'm going to go in with my l'oreal shampoo it's good for your hair As you guys can see that this is the color that I achieved <laughs> and it's so beautiful and guys even after dyeing the hair the hair the quality is on another level so guys this is my old 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 wig and I just decided to cut it and dye it however the closure I bought it from a friend if you guys have an old wig that you wanna revamp that you wanna you know i'll leave her details down in the description box or right here so that you can you know ask her how much is the closure inches and everything so yeah i love the quality the reason why i'm recommending her is because even after dying the closure the quality stiff way sis <laughs> i'm loving it so yeah guys until next time don't forget to subscribe share like and comment Bye.